Good morning, my name is Doug Gillen, and I'm a member of the Orange County Grand Jury. I have a couple of questions for you this morning. How many of you have been to Disneyland? I see those hands out there, and the mouse thanks you. Now, here's a trick question. How many of you have been behind the scenes at Disneyland? Ah, not so many. And why? Because in order to get behind the scenes, you have to have a special pass. You have to be an employee of the mouse or know somebody who is. Now, as a member of the Orange County Grand Jury, you get to go behind the scenes of Orange County to see how things work and possibly discover why they don't. And in that discovery, you get to do an investigation and look for ways to improve the county. Yes, that may seem like an awful re big responsibility, but as a member of the grand jury, you're empowered to go investigate, report, make recommendations, and hold the agencies in Orange County accountable that they are efficient and they're also spending your tax dollars effectively. Now, as a grand jury member, you'll be working with 18 other members of the panel formed into functional investigative committees so that you can look at county operations, cities, health and human services, environment and transportation, criminal justice, and special issues and ethics. Now that may sound like an awful lot, but you've got the skills to come in and help improve the county on a regular basis. Now as a grand jury member, this is going to be a little more responsibility than just sitting on a jury panel for a day or two. The responsibilities of the grand jury require that you be on site and ready to go for one year. You will receive $50 a day as well as per diem for your travel. You'll also be assigned a special parking spot right underneath the courthouse so you don't have to walk two blocks from the stadium as you would if you were in a petit jury. Now, as part of your duties as a grand jury member, you will have the opportunity to go behind the scenes of many of the operations here in Orange County that most people have no idea even exist. You may get a tour of the jail, a tour of the airport possibly, or the water district, the crime lab, maybe even the coroner's office. These are all tours that the grand jury has opportunities to participate in. You'll also meet and greet key elements of our leadership here in the county. Elected officials, as well as appointed officials, will have an opportunity to come in and explain a little bit more about what their operations are, what their duties are, and how their different departments contribute to the overall welfare of the county. Now, as a potential candidate, we have a few things that we need you to have. You need to be an Orange County resident for at least one year. You need to be a citizen of the United States at least 18 years of age. Have a fairly working knowledge of the English language. And a little computer skills is a plus. Now, we take all of the normal court holidays, and our tour of service is from July 1st to June 30th of the following year. Now, if you can't be a member of the grand jury, but you know somebody who might, we encourage you to get the information that we have on our website, which is ocgrandjury.org. And if you go to that website, you can also see past reports that we have written over many years looking for ways to improve the county. So please consider applying for the Orange County Grand Jury. It is an opportunity, as I said, to go behind the scenes and look for ways to improve the county. Many years ago, I worked for a company here in Irvine whose motto was that quality is the belief that anything can be made better. We are looking for applicants who truly believe that there are ways to improve the county. And you as citizens have the opportunity to participate in that process. Please join us and we thank you.